you know who they are, don't you? <laughs> you do obviously know who they are. That's probably why you clicked on this video is because that one person, that, that group of people came to mind. So what are you doing? What are you going to do after this video in order to improve your life as a whole? Because the truth is, is that you are the average of your friend group. You are the average of the people that you spend your time around and including your friends, including good friends into your space is by far the best investment that you can make. Now, why is that? Okay, so let's say that you're in the middle of all these degenerate friends who always say that, oh yeah, this is fine, this is okay. Let's say that you go into a group of gamer friends. You don't even want to go into that group of gamer friends, but you go into the group anyway because they seem kind of fun, right? Sorry, I got to adjust my microphone. They seem kind of fun, right? If you're in that group of gamer friends, I mean, not only are they going to try to entice you to partake in playing video games, but they're also going to always be talking about video games, right? Like, oh yeah, that video game was really fun. That video game was really fun. Not only are you going to know a lot about video games, but you're also going to want to play video games. You're going to want to be like them, especially if these people are the people that you want to be like. These people have good social status. They, it's a large friend group. You have lots of friends because of them. Obviously, to maintain your friendship and to level it up, you're obviously going to want to play that game. And this applies to everything. This applies to masturbation. This applies to drugs. This applies to scrolling on YouTube, TikTok. Have you seen that one TikTok? You feel left out. You don't have TikTok. You download it. Boom, you're addicted to TikTok. Have you seen that new Angela White video? You, you haven't, you've kind of dabbled in porn, but you haven't really watched it fully. Oh, let me look it up. Boom. You're hooked. I mean, yeah, you're probably already addicted to porn. That's what everybody is. That's the new normal in this day and age. But you see what I'm getting at. Have you tried that new Zah? <laughs> no, you haven't. So you try it and you become fully psychologically addicted. So when you are surrounding yourself with all these losers, what do you expect yourself to become after surrounding yourself with them? After these hangouts that you have with all of them smoking right in front of you? Because I used to be in that friend group. My friends used to vape in my car. My friends used to smoke weed in my car. I would let them, right? Because I'm the cool friend, right? I'm the person who drives them home. I'm the person who lets... I'm that one cool friend who lets everyone smoke in my car. Needless to say, I did some bad things with those guys that I would... I don't really wish I could take it back, right? It was, it was a life experience, but I do... I don't want the same for you because I could very easily have gotten into a hole after the things that I did. Luckily, I didn't. Luckily, I had the self-control. Luckily, I deleted Snapchat. Luckily, I don't talk to them anymore. Now, when you... That was the negative side, right? You're surrounding yourself with all these negative people right now, and you understand the consequences, and yet you still don't leave them. And hopefully, me telling you all the negative benefits that these people are giving you, all the negative benefits, these people are sandpaper, rubbing their life onto you, rubbing their wants their likes everything that they enjoy their pleasures that is what a friend group is it's sandpaper making you conform now if you actually surround yourself with great people people who actually want to succeed people who are successful then how will you end up now i don't give a shit how you need to get there do you need to pay for a networking program do you need to go outside and cold approach these people who look rich? I don't give a shit. But you need to find these people. Because this is what will propel you forward. Because it's not only you wanting to conform with your ideals when you're with these people, right? But it's also competition. Competition between these people. Who can make the most money in the shortest period of time? Who can go the longest? Abstaining from something. YouTube. 
porn, drugs. Who can do this? Who can do that? And even if it's unspoken, you still feel that drive of competition. You still want to get ahead of these people, right? Instead of in the degenerate group, thinking, focusing all your brain points on how you can get that one girl to fuck you. You're focusing on all these good things, all these good things leveling yourself up instead of your social status. It actually doesn't mean anything because it's between this entire degenerate group of people, which quite frankly is basically 90% of our generation, isn't it? Find the 10%. Find the people who you can surround yourself with, who you can actually either admire or work towards with them to get to your goal. Now, I do have a private community, but if you want to, obviously, I've got a shortcut that you can pay for. But if you want to, you can go outside, you can cold approach, you can try talking to new people in your group. But if that sounds of anything of interest to you and you want to get mentored by me, then definitely go in the link in the description and click that link right now. And those are the benefits of being with a friend group. I'll let you decide what the right decision is. Degenerate or non-degenerate? Hardworking or losers? Success or poverty? Which one will you choose? Because I think that the answer is pretty obvious. And I hope that you think the same. If you like this video, my channel name is him, not because I'm him, but because we're all striving to be him, right? And hopefully I can help you in that journey just as I did today. So if you like that message, then do subscribe and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.